Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and this is Disclosure, coming to you from the frozen plains of sunny western New York State, in Science Valley, south of Rochester, north of Hell. And I'm going to continue on this theme of these uh, strange lines that I'm seeing everywhere, these parallel lines. I would almost be tempted to think that these are... Uh, Plowed rows, but the problem is they're too far above the area for these to be plowed rows. So the question we have to ask is what are they? And I really can't come to any conclusion, but what I am going to say is they appear to be pipeline system. If this cooperates with me, I'm going to show you what I mean. There's an arrow, and then there's a pipe that casts a shadow. I believe this to be a pipeline system. That's my current thinking. I'm perplexed why other Mars researchers aren't talking about this. Uh, there's a lot of these lines where you defined, and I'd be most delighted if others would talk about this and help show the public, maybe somebody who has better ratings than I do, even if you got to take my video and put it on your channel, that's fine, I don't make any money doing this anyway, so what do I care? No copyright. Anyway, we're trying, going to try to get a good look at these. This one extends down. North is to the right, by the way. So these line, these particular lines extend down here. And they seem to stop when they start up over here. Remember, I've ruled out the idea that this could be a photographic anomaly because... Uh, that in some cases they follow the contours of the land, which photographic anomaly can't do. And there's a clear line, uh, not intending any pun, but there's a clear line of demarcation here, which means it's something that goes across the surface, not in a random sense, but it goes right across in... Uh, a pre-planned area. This isn't natural, folks. And that brings me to what apparently is a building. And we're going to take a little time on this one. I'm going to bring it down because this is kind of interesting. These things go directly across it. And if you look real close... You might have to do this on your own computer if you have Google Earth. But these things definitely go through this thing. There's an example, and they go over a little chasm or ditch or whatever. And then they continue on. So maybe this is some type of pumping station or... Something like that. Who knows? So why don't we try to... We're going to take this down. And I'm going to try to give you a... Not really ground level view, but... A better view of this formation. We can see once again these things follow the contour of this object, so even if it isn't natural, uh, they aren't. Even if it is natural, they are not natural. They're not a photographic anomaly, because photographic anomalies can't do that. Period in the subject. Now, the part that appears to me 
artificial here is this bottom area, the darker area. I'm thinking that is probably not natural. And then, if you can see it, there's a bunch of these that come off the side of this area. This looks like industry to me. It may be old and obsolete and no good anymore, but that's what it looks like. So, what you going to say about this? I mean, how is it that this information is just being basically ignored? I'm going to put north back to the right. So I'm actually headed south. And here we have some uh, rather interesting objects as well. Although I do have to caution that one thing I found out about these Martian craters is they can be very deceptive in their appearance. So you can make up your own mind whether you think these are craters or buildings or whatever. But it doesn't look like to, uh, they're actually craters because it's just the white part is sticking up above the shadow. So I'm thinking not. We'll take a look at all there's. You can judge for yourself, but in my book... We got something interesting there. Something that's casting a shadow and shouldn't be. And again. And if you have very good eyes, you'll be able to see tracks all through here. Tracks and uh, balls. Why don't we go ahead and take a picture of this? Hang on. Okay, just for grins, I've taken down the uh, lighting and increased contrast. Looks like vegetation to me. Um, perhaps some sort of cactus type vegetation. Not really sure. Very, very odd. But that's the point here is that uh, all this is all wrong. Of course, NASA will never admit it unless we're forced to. Unless somehow we got boots on the ground, we've showed the world that's what's here. Then NASA will be forced to tell the truth. Other than that, I don't think they're going to. This is why I say educate the public on this subject and screw what the government says. Because they're not telling you the truth. They're lying, 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 lying. Alright, we'll get back to Google Earth here. This is that same area. So it's interesting, you know, we have what are apparently pipelines. And there's, here's that object again. I believe these to be pipelines, underground pipelines. Sometimes they're on the surface, sometimes they're not. It could be that, you know, they're partially buried in the... Martian terrain and partially above. It would be hard to tell while getting boots on the ground to see what exactly is going on with that. Mm. 
And in many places like this thing appear to be overgrown by vegetation, which is also pretty remarkable. Well, that about wrap up this session. I want you to remember that you're being lied to, people. I've told you and told you and told you. And others have told you too. Now, I don't pay any attention to flat earth people or people saying we've never gone to the moon. Those are nut jobs. But when you see something like this, it's pretty hard to ignore the fact that you're seeing plants, you're seeing vegetation. I can show you the same exact thing on earth. It wouldn't be hard to find something that looks like this. Except on Mars, we're expected to ignore it, and on Earth, well, it's okay, it's just Earth plants, we know what they are. These people talk out, out of uh, both sides of their mouths. On one hand, if you show them, if you show them this picture and you saw it was Earth, they say, oh, so what? It looks like desert southwest. Tell them it's Mars, and they're going to say, oh, there's no life there, you're not seeing life. Hogwash. Solar area is full of these uh, pipelines or whatever they are, and it's full of life too. So wake up, people. You're not being told the truth. I've told you this before. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching. Get out there, get on Google Earth, and show people about Mars. Show them the truth. Damn it. How can we formulate public policy if we don't show them the truth? I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.